I got a birthday present from a football club. Happy birthday, Thank man. you. Exclusive pitch side access with football legends and even a rare gift. I don't think it gets much better than this. Today's my birthday. But we have to go back three weeks to find out how this all happened. I got an email from a club to celebrate not only mine, but their stadium's birthday. We can't tell you too much yet, but it will be a very special match day. I was a little nervous, as I didn't know if it was real, but I still said yes. Little did I know, I was in for an experience of a lifetime, and one of you guys can win this trip later in the video. It's match day, and we had a flight to catch. Saturday, 6th of April, we're about to catch a flight to a football club that have surprised me with a birthday gift. Get our bags packed and head. To As you can see in England, it was cloudy and cold after a 55 minute flight and a rough landing. That's the weather I'm talking about. We've landed in Germany. If you've seen my other Dortmund videos, we always go to the same spot before the match. And I knew the email was real when they said, meet at Strobbles about two and a half hours before the game. So we headed to the stadium and en route, I made the best prediction of all time. I bet the coach is about to appear out of nowhere. Oh, there it is. Ready to go. In England, three hours before kickoff around the stadium, it's quiet. But in Dortmund, they do things different. I've never seen a stadium so busy around the ground. Four, three for Borussia Dortmund. Three for Dortmund yeah. and two for Stuttgart. Two, one for Borussia Dortmund. Two, one. Four, nil. Okay. We're gonna smash them. We even found some away fans. One, two for Stuttgart. Two, four for Stuttgart. But you really yeah. think you're better than Dortmund? The table isn't lying. But with time against us, we headed to the Strobbles to meet the man behind the emails. It was busy and hard to navigate, but we luckily found him. And we begun the experience with some beers. Ollie, what's going on there? I was in Cyprus, so I have to uh, stay a little bit uh, without alcohol. He's got a hangover right now. Final verdict from the fans. <laughs> to, to me! Yeah! Ah, thank you, too, God. Before Yari told us it was time to go, we made our way past security through a special entrance. See you, this is the first surprise. The bus will arrive in like five minutes. Hopefully you like it. The coach is going to arrive yeah. right behind me. This is insane. I was the only one there, and moments later, the bus parked up. Is that Emre Chan smiling back at us? It's insane. Give him a little wave. Once the lads were in the ground, it was our turn, leading us to my second birthday surprise. Since the start of 2020, I've been to matches here, but Yari wanted to show us somewhere we've never been. As far as birthday surprises go, I don't think it gets much better than this. Pitch side, yellow wall behind, but that wasn't it. Second surprise, yeah. you know, 50th anniversary. Yeah, here's our special kit. Hopefully you like it. I had received the special kit the players would be wearing today. Unbelievable. Made solely for one game to celebrate 50 years at this fortress. Puma only created a limited number and it was sold out in minutes. Now we're ready for the match day. Come on. But my third surprise was getting even more crazy. I was about to bump into a Ballon d'Or and World Cup winner. Let me introduce Lothar. Mateus here, pitch side at the match. It's a massive game, 50 year anniversary for the stadium. Not only the anniversary, the game today, but uh, sure, 50 years, this stadium. It's amazing. It's, I love I, it. I played many times here, not only with the club teams, the same national teams, and you get this big support from the fans. I couldn't believe how nice Lothar was to me, but I had one final question. Can you give us a score prediction today? 3-1. Three three we also bumped into a famous actor in Frederick Lau, who showed belief. 2-1 today. Low scoring, but, a win. but passion. Yeah, <laughs> you okay. You sure right. Just wait till we see the display at kickoff. Hold on. Is that the managers of both clubs coming to our area? And this is the manager listening to the yellow wall for the first time. It mustn't be easy being the away team here. Giving time for every single fan. This is beautiful. I was even spotted by German thug dad in the crowd. Remember, one of you guys are coming with me next time. Dortmund are inviting five people from five different continents for next season's opening match. And if you want to join me, comment the country you're from and the reason you'd love to be here. The link is in the description for more information and we're not even finished yet with two more surprises that you won't believe. I offered Julian Brandt some final tactics and then we had to rush to our seat for the next birthday surprise. Our seat had a lifted view directly above the biggest stand in football. Scarfs were out for you never walk alone. The lineups got us all fired up. Then our fourth surprise, maybe the greatest choreo I've ever seen in the stadium. Imagine being a player coming out to see this. West Ballon Stadion is growing up. But let's check it out from the other side. West Fallon in the east, 50 in the south. Simply spectacular. You almost forget about the match, but it finally kicked off below us. Go on, Gus. Adiemi on the right, wandering into the box. VAR! You've got to look at VAR! Now you're probably wondering what the fifth and final surprise is. Stuttgart fans had a full black pyro display pouring into the home end. It's going on the Dortmund fans. The fans are feeling, look at this. This is the response. Borussia Dortmund! 
they had no choice but to pause the game. German football is just next level. With all five surprises complete, that reminds me, everybody that hits the like, that is a happy birthday message. Don't feel the need to comment. But this doesn't come close to the next display later in the match. They're making as much noise as they can in the away end. They're passionate, they're third in the league. They've come with a lot of fight. With playback underway, it's Emre Chan. Oh. It nearly brought him the luck there. All the fans together here. Whole yellow wall. All in synchronization. Chance after chance. Adiemi. But they just couldn't find the net. So close, Adiemi. Through on goal, use this pace for the finish. This much away. Cheers. Nice to meet you. Making friends here. Goalless in the Bundesliga at half time. You don't often say that. Stuttgart are a good team. There's no denying that. Full time score. 2 2. But nothing at the break could prepare us for this. Oh my god. What is going on? This is magnificent. The pride of Dortmund have done it again with red flares all around. They might get in trouble for this, maybe a fine or a suspension, but they don't care. It's the 50 year anniversary of this beautiful stadium, and it's a day to remember. From Oli's seat, it was just as special. And the thick air of mist stuck around after. You couldn't even see part of the stand. However, on the pitch, pressure was building, and Stuttgart were on top. There's no doubt Stuttgart are a very good team. The Dortmund fans began to get frustrated. Another chance down the right flank. Low ball played in. It's that man we were all talking about, Garassi. Look at those away fans. An important goal for Stuttgart to hedge even further in the Bundesliga Champions League spots. The Guinea International does it again, breaking the deadlock in the 64th minute. The 50th year anniversary. This was meant to be part of the celebration. The result not ideal, but the birthday party didn't stop. The fans stood behind them. That's the response. That's the real response. The fans don't care. Let's save the fans. Sancho with the corner. It's a good one. Chance go in. Free header. Save. Nico Schlotterbeck, you must do better. How did you miss that? It's getting a bit heated now. It's harder to miss than score. Another chance, but nothing from it as we reach the 90. Nine minutes additional time. Anything can change. Jaden. Sancho with a solo run. Oh. Another shot, not good enough. Full time. So the football wasn't perfect, but my 23rd birthday was. No matter the result, these fans are here for them, and that's what I respect the most. To feel the yellow wall pitch side, meeting stars like Mateus, joining in with a full stadium choreo, these are memories I'll never forget. It was an honour sharing a birthday with West Fallon Stadion.